try another video uh, test with the Sony A7 and the Lumix G9. Why I did the test, this test? Because everybody is speaking about bokeh, better bokeh with the Sony and less bokeh with the G9. It's absolutely not true. It depends how you use your camera. Very easy to understand because a full frame from the Sony is four times bigger than the micro four third. Then if you take a picture exactly the same with four stop less on the micro four third, you will have exactly the same picture and the same bokeh. Of course you need to have the same focal length. Focal length I did it with uh, 50 millimeters. 50 millimeters is 25 on micro four third and it's uh, 50 on the Sony. Sony. Okay, look at that. Almost same bokeh. Why almost? Because uh, during the time I change the lens, uh, I change uh, okay. Uh, the sun uh, moved a little bit. All picture was done with f 2.8 and uh, with 800 uh, ISO for stop more on the Sony and 200 ISO on the Lumix. Okay, you see, but the, the exposure time change, then it's why you have a little, because you have one 8000 uh, on the Sony and you have only one 3200 on the Lumix, that's why, okay, I will show you the second one, you see this one, it's uh, all same things, four stop less, 200 ISO, 2.8 aperture, and one 5000 on the exposure time, the second one, same one, I have again one 8,000 instead of one 5,000. That's why you have a little, little difference with the bokeh. You see, I go back on this one. This one, the bokeh is, is a little bit less blur because it's not exactly five stop less. It's three, uh, four stop, uh, no, uh, four stop less, it's three something. Okay, because I was already uh, with uh, the Sony, I uh, went uh, with, uh, I did the picture with uh, 50 millimeters macro from Sony. I tried to do the same with two macro lens. I put the uh, Zwicko uh, Olympus 30 millimeters look the quality of the picture the second one okay and uh, here i didn't pay attention for the aperture the speed and everything and then you will see what i try to do is to give some advantages to the g9 then i have a little bit more uh, depth of field on the Lumix. You see here, it's the Sony. Look at that, the Sony, perfect. I go here, and here, and here, it's a little bit blurry. I go on the Panasonic. Here, it's less blurry. Here it's perfect to like the sun. Then 
for me, I still don't understand the fight between uh, Microsoft Serve and Full Frame because you can have exactly the same pictures if you want the same picture. If you don't want the, the same pictures, both camera has advantages. Uh, I will do another uh, video to show you uh, with the two camera different lenses what is the advantages of each camera. For me, my bag now I have a A7 III with a shorter uh, lens, focal lens, no more than uh, 70 millimeters, and I have the Micro Four Serve with all the lens bigger than uh, 70 millimeters until uh, 300 and like this I have a small factor very good result even in low light with the A7 7 3 and uh, very good picture far away with the G9. Thank you have a nice day bye see you soon